Hey guys, welcome back to Quack Math. My name is Holly Gonzalez Oriana, and we are going to be focusing today's episode in Central Mass, specifically more in Worcester. And what we are looking here today is two different universities and comparing both of them for a specific office that they both provide. And in one hand, I have Worcester State University, and in the other hand, I have Worcester Polytechnic institute and the office that they both provide that we will be comparing is the math center and i'm the kind of girl that quite enjoys math if i will be quite honest and if you enjoy math as well i hope this catches your ears not your eyes (laughs) i for one am a student at worcester state university and i have had my own connections to the math center and i'll get more into that later on um but i firstly want to talk about what the math center provides for both worcester state university and worcester polytechnic institute and what you can expect coming from their websites As many might ask, what does the office or organization do? And with the math center, it's staffed with supervisors and or peer tutors that can provide help for you with mathematical concepts or problems that you need more help in depth with understanding. As well as they have drop-in services that have tutoring or just assistance. For services at Worcester State University, they only have it through Monday to Thursday, but depending on what kind of math course you need help in, you need to look at their schedule to specifically see when somebody is available to help tutor you during that. Regardless if you're not needed for tutoring, but you would most most likely like assistance you can mainly go towards the office hours that your professor provides for you as well as comparing to the Worcester Polytechnic Institute website for the math center um, they provide services from Monday to Friday but the hours vary and as well as going along with Worcester State University, you need to look at the schedule of tutors by course to see when and at what time you should be able to drop in by to, to gain the help that you need. What I like about both universities is that there are no appointments needed and that you can also just drop in, which I quite enjoy. Um, but um, for Worcester State, on their website, they do have placement test materials, which can help many different people, but they only have it for different for math categories. But it's more of an upper hand that they give than comparing to Worcester Polytechnic Institute, I might add. Regardless, if you go to Worcester State University or Worcester Polytechnic Institute, or if you don't go to neither, um, if your school does provide the math center or any form of it, that office is an amazing aspect for students because as I've heard from many years throughout my experience with school, many students seem to have more trouble with math comparing to other subjects. And the math center is a great gain in a helping hand for students as well as for Worcester State University student population because as I've stated earlier I have had my own experience of going there myself. Although it was required for my math classes to go to the math center personally I did have good experiences as I have been there. For the first time I've ever went to the math center it wasn't like a terrible experience but it was more in the aspect that it was kind of hard on the tutor as there were multiple students there needing their help and there was only one of them. But by the end of it, um, as they did help me out, I was able to help out my peers around me as well, which made it a good time. And there was another time when I was there 
that even though I came in at the wrong time, there were other tutors there for different math courses, but they asked if I needed help regardless that they could try and help me out, which was very sweet of them to do. As well as if you don't feel like going to a stranger per se at a math center, always go to your professor, which is always another amazing thing to gain help for math. Never be scared to ask for help. I personally have a friend that goes to Worcester Polytechnic Institute as they are a sophomore this year. They have said that during their freshman year, they were able to go to the math center and as they were there, it was quite helpful on their part. And they have told me that the times that they have went, it wasn't quite as busy as they expected. Same goes for when I have went to the tutoring center. Um, besides that one time, the rest of the time, it was pretty bare with students there. Um, but with my friend at Worcester Polytechnic Institute, they said that possibly calculus would have had more um, appearances of students gaining help there. All in all, both universities have services that are helpful in the aspect for the student to gain a better understanding for them to succeed better in their math course. It was refreshing to see, although one school is private and the other is public, that both provide services that are no different from one another. That's all that I have for you guys today. Thank you for listening. Goodbye.